It was very common in the 70s, 80s and 90s and early 2000s for a family to use blank VHS tapes and record their favourite TV shows. Most of the time, tapes have been recorded over numerous times. And now it's up to me to find the lost mystery VHS tape and see what shit we can salvage. This is mystery tape time. What is up YouTube? I am back with another mystery tape from the box of mystery tapes that I brought from someone online. There we've got the mask. Let me show you what we found on this tape. All recorded from the VHS straight to the computer so we can edit and show you all the good stuff and we'll fast forward all the crap. This is Mystery Tapes episode 4 baby. Let's do this. Come on. Cool. <laughs> And right now, you could get twice as much fun out of your Aquatechnics pool. Because everyone who buys one has a very good chance of winning one of three I love it when you put a tape straight into the VHS player and you don't know what's going to be on there and you press play. we got Aquatechnics pools, so you already know it's going to be a 90s, 90s video, plus because it said the mask, but let's, let's show you what else was on this video. With million lives affected by a dam, it was the dam problem of unemployment that you wanted your say about this week following on from last week's second of our youth forum. So this is good. Uh, we get some uh, political arguments about unemployment where some of these teens are just... <laughs> All right, have a look at this. You say to the millions of people that are watching you here tonight, and they say that you should change your appearance and get a job. He does not look happy. He does not look happy at all that he's been told to change his appearance and get a job. How dare you tell someone to change their appearance and get a job? Prepared to say grow dreadlocks and dye them green to keep your job as a media personality. Damn! He just owned you, boy! He owned you then! He owned you! Douglas Young, the nation's number one problem, we got together successful young people with others who cannot find or won't accept full-time... I, at the moment, am getting up five days a week at 5am to do three hours work a day. Boo hoo hoo, cry as a fucking river. You're getting up at 5am, I get up at 5am every day to go to work. I get up at 5am, and then I still work when I get up. Keep going. They won't accept full-time work, or they won't take it. So these kids just don't want help. The 90s kids just didn't want help. I'm, all I'm saying is, and I'm not trying to be a smarty pants by saying this, if you're fair dinkum, my office tomorrow morning at 7am. There you go, he's not trying to be a smarty pants. If you're fair dinkum, come to his office tomorrow morning. Now what happened? What do you think happened? For the most talked about issue in your letters, did she or didn't she turn up for that job interview? Well, the answer is, she didn't. Of course she didn't. Of course she didn't. The following program is classified M. The Nine Network recommends viewing by mature audiences. It contains some violence. So we got the mask. We're going to fast forward through the mask. We're just going to go straight to the ads. Straight to the ads. Jody's passion-filled adventure. The photos all the world's been waiting for. The handsome TV cops a whirl. He's in love with the lovable girl. And a Melrose wedding's bound to cause uproar. There's stress-free superfoods for busy women. And sex by numbers spices up your day. Once you pick it up, it's hard to put it down. It's all a part of every woman's day. If that didn't want to make you buy a woman's day, it would have made me switch the channels. I would have switched the channels straight away. Split with a 600ml Coca-Cola and get your own cool split t-shirt. Just send in 20 labels. with a coca-cola 600 mil i don't know if this is just my opinion or not but was coca-cola just promoting crime was coca-cola promoting you have a coke 
you will get away from crime faster. Go break into places. Go break into places. And just run away. You'll get away if you've got a Coca-Cola. Take a 375 mil Coca, regular chips and chicken treats, chicken char burger supreme. And for just 445, you've got the new chicken char burger supreme combo. Only a chicken treat. $4.45, that is a bargain. You've got a chips, you've got a Coke, you've got a burger. I think I want chicken treat now. <laughs> right there's one of my biggest hates of public transport. You've got a dickhead sitting next to you laughing. Uh, <laughs> I don't want you to fucking be near me. Fuck off. This is me, I in Bali. And right there is where I would have fucking knocked those photos out of his hand said, I don't give a fuck about you going to Bali, mate. We've all been to Bali, we all live over here, and we all go to Bali all the time, because it's cheap, all right? Now fuck off and sit somewhere else. Go. Go. This is me, in Rio. You can get away with anything in Rio. That's got to be the greatest ad ever. Imagine that. Imagine someone just go on the public transport and just do it. Greatest ad ever. Greatest ad ever. Let's keep going. Ow! These women were waiting. These women knew and were waiting for the Coca-Cola guy to rock up and they were getting all... Would you look at that? Look. He's bringing in Coca-Cola, Diet Coke, on his shoulders. She's hot. She's hot for it. She's fucking dripping. He's having a... He just pulls a Coke out and has a drink. Is he allowed to pull a Coke out and have a drink? You can't do that. You're, you're working at the moment. And then she licks the sweat off. Drippy, drippy sweat. The right wine to go with your favourite food can often seem a complete puzzle. And this is true. This is true, it's hard to find the right wine with the right food. And show the way with a complete system. Do they still do this system? This is actually a really smart idea. I don't know if they've I've ever seen this. The symbols tell you the exact food that goes with many of their wines. Try the food and wine matching system that opens up a whole new world. At Liquorland, where wine and food in the comments do they actually still do that at Liquorland or at the uh, bottle shop saying what wine that goes with what food because that is a brilliant smart idea 90s you were smart 90s 90s was smart <laughs> Basically the message in that, basically the message in that ad was drink a strongbow and you'll pick up a skank. Drink a strongbow and you will get some. Drink a strongbow and the legs will open. Is this true about strongbow? Is this true about strongbows? That's a pretty bad ad. All right, so the mask has turned into cool runnings. Cool runnings has been taped over the mask. Um, they didn't even finish. They didn't care about the ending. They didn't care about what happened. So we're fast forwarding through this and hopefully we get some more ads again. Summer hair was brought to life with colour. A great cut finished with strong colour. You always notice great looking hair. Morris Mead. Some of those haircuts were terrible. Terrible, Morris Mead. Come on, man. The new hero, Raw, premieres Wednesday on 10. So Heath Ledger's first TV series there, uh, Raw. This is how I established that this is video from 1997 because that's when Raw debuted on public television for Australia. So this is a 1997 video. So we kept on fast forwarding uh, through the rest of the crap that was on here because there was a heap of ads that were absolutely shit and that were about cars. 
Uh, then we had some late night show which just stopped and then that was the end of the tape unfortunately. So in the end, not a very good episode, not a very good tape, but you can't always win, you don't know what's going to be on these mystery tapes, so this was from 1997, so we'll up the chart there, and uh, there's our list of all the years so far of what we've had, and 1997 joins the crew. Thanks heaps for joining us uh, on the mystery tapes, I'll be back next week, and hopefully we have a better tape that we choose from the uh, box to watch. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and I do have my kiss reviews if you like that, and I do have uh, some horror stuff hosted by trolls once a week as well. Uh, but thanks a lot. Uh, click like, subscribe, and we'll be back next week. Unfortunately, the mask was a disappointing tape. I'm going to have to smash this tape. I'm going to have to smash this tape against the rocks now. I'm going to go take it and smash it. See you!